why? Why did you let me go? Don't you realize that being nice just makes you get hurt? Look at yourself. You made all these great friends, but now you'll probably never see them again. Not to mention how much they've been set back by you. Hurts, doesn't it? If you had just gone through uh, without caring about anyone, you wouldn't have to feel bad now. So I don't get it. If you really did everything the right way, why did things still end up like this? Why? Is life really that unfair? Yeah. Say, what if I told you- Oh. Oh? Say, what if I told you I knew some way to get you a better ending? You'll have to load your save file and- Well, in the meantime, why don't you go see Dr. Alphys? It seems like you could have been better friends. Who knows? Maybe she's got the key to your happiness. See you soon. Long uh, time ago, two races ruled over Earth. Humans and monsters. We know the deal. Mm -hmm. Poor Ready to see Alphys? Sure. I'm pretty sure that what he was just gonna say was probably do the genocide run or something. I don't know. Why did I carry the dog residue with me? Alright. I don't know. I thought it was weird too when you first put it in your pocket. Alright. Uh. Time to walk back. <laughs> Asgore's not dead in this timeline. We loaded right before we killed him. Aw. Oh. Oh my god, we met Stans here. We did. My screen just froze for a second. Yeah. I remember. Okay, uh, there we go. Mm -hmm. It's just my OBS said something about, like, whoa there. Whoa All there, right. buddy. Elevator. I miss Toria. You know, me too. Hey, look at where we are. Hey, hey. we're here. Yep. Man. Walking simulator. <laughs> Metaton's gone. Yeah. Man, I sure do love being filled with determination. I sure do love being filled. Hey. <laughs> Ring. Hey, uh, this is Undyne. Shut up, Papyrus. This was your idea. Human, you have to deliver something for me. Uh. Please? I'm at Snowden in front of Papyruses. See ya, punk. We have to go to Snowden's anyway because we want to check out uh, Sans's thing. <laughs> Let me save. Oh boy. Wrong area. I keep forgetting I can't just go straight down. Hey, Heat's Flamesman. Whoosh. Man. This Man. is ominous music. Yeah, this is the normal music that played when we got here. I know, but it's still Oh my god, it's ominous. the dog boat! <laughs> oh. We deserve this. We deserve the dog boat. Man, we're gonna have so much trauma. <laughs> Bruh. Tra-la-la, -la, I hear <laughs> the 
here, Asgore has a favorite food. Oh well, what type? Tra la la, none of your fucking business. <laughs> Why would you tell me that without even telling me what it is? Like, that's just. <sighs> Come again sometime. Tra la la. Man, it's been a while since we've been here. We sure. It, it uh, sure has. Let's check out Sans's room first. We just walk past them and they're just like standing emoji. Yeah. You unlock <laughs> the door and enter. There's fire in there. Hey, this is like from before. Man, this this sure sounds ominous. Standing emoji. <laughs> oh. Oh. Wow. Hey, Sans. Have you seen my... Oh, hello. You aren't Sans. Wait a second. Why were you using a treadmill in the dark? <laughs> Is Sans pranking you across space- time and space? He can do that? I hate it when he does that! Well... I hate people who work at the bank! Shh, I work at the bank. Here is a dollar. God. Anyone. That's a spaghetti in the tornado. How Im <laughs> How immature can you get? Also, have you seen my action figures? Wait, I know where to look. In my collection. <laughs> Sometimes I'm a genius all the time. <laughs> Man, if my if my school allowed me to have like senior quotes, I would choose that one. God. It's Sans this dirty soft pile. Oh. Sc scandalous. <laughs> It's a treadmill. There's a message attached. The truth is that you got owned, nerd. Thanks, San. Uh, okay. Inside the drawer is a silver key. You put it on your keychain. We're just stealing keys now? It's a thank you letter. It's addressed to Santa. Oh. It's an under- It's an under- Uncovered. Uncovered. Undercovered. Uncovered pillow. It's a, a worn mattress. Lettuce? <laughs> oh. Sheets are bunched up in a weird <laughs> um, crazy ball. Damn, bitch. I almost you said like cheesy. I almost said cheesy for some weird reason. Alright. Tornado. It appears to be a self sustaining tornado made of trash. It has a it has a piece of spaghetti. Like I or said, a plate trash. Of Man, damn, bitch, it's you look a lamp. like this. Turn it on. There's no yeah. light bulb. A flashlight is stuck in the bulb socket. Turn is it this... on. Yeah. Yeah. The flashlight is out of batteries. This is the saddest room I've ever seen in my life. God. Anyways, like, this makes we got a my key from there. Feels nice. Whoops. We got a key from there. Mm -hmm. Isn't that interesting, you know? How we got a key and we don't know we where to go? Good? Like... Are we... Hey, you're <laughs> using the back entrance? You unlocked the door and entered. Oh? There's a photo album inside the drawer. There are photos of Sans with a lot of people you don't recognize. He looks happy. Oh. You look in the drawer, there's some kind of a badge. Blueprints. You can't read uh, the symbols they're written in. Or maybe it's just the handwriting. Looks like they relate to some kind of strange machine. Hmm. There's a strange machine behind the curtain. It seems to be broken. Meditate. Alright. 
how did okay back to under <laughs> wow um so i have a favor to ask you uh i need you to deliver this letter to dr alphas huh why don't i do it myself um well yes. it's kind of personal we're friends so I i'll tell you hotland sucks and i don't want to go over there so here uh -huh. you go yeah sure she almost died That's there. Delicious. What do you mean? I'm just saying, like, if if you wanna, if you just don't wanna go to Hotland because it's just hot, then like, okay. But like, I think it's because of some repressed feelings. God, you got Undyne's letter. Oh, and if you read it, I'll kill you. Thanks so well, much. You're the best. Man, don't read it. Hey, I'm watching Undyne's you. Undyne's letter. Uh, God. Unique letter written for Dr. Alphys. <laughs> hey! <laughs> no! Oh my god, I'm gonna freaking kill you. Okay. Why'd you do that? I didn't actually open it. She Good. stopped me. You open it somewhere far away from her and she calls you being like, I know you're opening the letter. <laughs> Tra -la -la, care for a ride? I mean, I can try it. No, don't. Respect her privacy. Okay. Eat a mushroom every day. Why? Then I know you're listening to me. Well, no need to be rude. Come again sometime. Tra -la -la. The door has no mail slot. Slide the letter under. Sure. You slide the letter under the door and give it a knock. Uh, oh no. Is that another letter? I, I don't want to open it. Can't I just slide it back out? No. I can't keep doing this. I'll read this one. Um, it's kind, it's kind of strongly, isn't it? Wait a second. Hey, if this is a joke, it's... Oh my god. Did, did you write this letter? It wasn't signed, so I had no idea who could have. Oh my god. Oh no. That's so adorable. Hey. And I had no idea you, um, wrote that way. What? Is Surprising, you... too, after all the gross stuff I did. Hey! Whoa! Oh. I don't really deserve to be forgiven, much less, um, this. So passionately, too. Oh, she fucking wrote erotica in there. <laughs> you know what? Okay, I'll do it. It's the least I can do to make it up to you. Yeah, let's go on a date. Whoa. Undertale Are we gonna is tell her? Undertale is a secret dating sim. Honestly. Dating start. Uh, sorry, I'm still getting dressed. H how do I look? Okay. My friend helped me pick out this dress. She's got a real sense of, uh, anyway, let's do this thing. Dating, start- H Hey, wait! A actually, we still can't start the date yet. Dating, stop? Um... I've got to give you items to raise your affection statistic first. That'll Bruh. increase the chance of a successful outcome to the date. Right? Anyways, don't worry, I'm prepared. I've been stockpiling gifts for anticipation for a date like this. First, I've got metal armor polish. Um, maybe you can't use that, but... I also brought some waterproof cream for your scales! I don't have- Your, uh, 
scales. Oh, she's in love with us. I knew it. Uh, yes. Well, how about this magical spear repair kit that I... Uh... Hey, let's forget about the items. Let's just start the date. Dating, start! Yeah, let's, uh, date. This is awkward. <coughs> Um, do you like anime? <laughs> yeah, you do. I know I do, but do, what's your response? Yeah, it's okay. You know, <laughs> you watch I, Sword I, Art I, Online. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> I only watched it because, um... You I also watch My Hero, Hero Academia, don't you? I mean, yeah, but not because... Not be. Uh, I don't even um, know what I can. I don't even know what I can say to defend myself. To be honest, I'm just gonna say yes. I've also hey, seen. Hey, Italia. shut up about Italia. <laughs> I'm so sick of Italians. <laughs> Fuck sick of Italians. Italians. All my homies hate Italians. Well. Hey, me too. <clears throat> Hey, let's go somewhere. But where's a good place to go on a date? I've got it! Let's go to the garbage dump! That's an awful place. Here we are! This is where Undy and I come all the time. Oh, oh, oh. We find all sorts of great stuff here. <laughs> She's really... Uh... Oh no. That's her over there. I can't let her see me on a date with you. Why? Because, well... Oh no, here she comes. Hey, there you are. I uh, realized oh. that if you deliver that thing, it might be a bad idea. So I'm going to do it. Give it to me. Huh? You don't have it? Ugh. Have you at least seen her? Yeah. Yeah? So she's somewhere around here. Thanks. I'll keep looking. Oh my god. Well, I guess it's obvious, huh? I, um, really like her. Yes. I mean, more than I like other people. I'm sorry. I just figured, you know, it'd be fun to go on, like, a cute kind of pretend date with you to make you feel better. That's not the reason. Well, it sounds even worse when I put it like that. I'm sorry, I messed up again. And then's the person I, um, really want to go on a date with. But I mean, she's way out of my league. Not that you aren't, um, cool, but Hyundai. She's so confident and strong and funny. I'm just a nobody. Fraud. I'm the royal scientist, but all I've ever done is hurt people. I've told her so many lies. She thinks I'm she thinks I'm a lot cooler than I actually am. If she gets close to me, she'll she'll find out the truth about me. What should I do? Tell her the truth. The truth? But if I tell her that, she'll hate me. Isn't it better this won't. way? To live a lie where both people are happy? Or a truth where neither of us are? They say be yourself. But I don't really like who myself is. I'd rather just be whatever makes people like me. Oh, you, <laughs> look, I feel you, dude. But like... <laughs> uh. No, you're right. Every day I'm scared. I'm scared what will happen if people learn the truth on their own. They'll all get hurt because of me. How can I tell Undyne the tr truth? I don't have the confidence. I'm going to mess it up. How can I practice? Practice on me. Oh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'll be- <laughs> Roleplay! <laughs> 
All right, but which for which one do you want to say? The first one, because the second one sounds weird. But roleplay? That actually sounds kind of fun. Okay, which one of us will be Undyne? Obviously me! God damn it. Oh, right. Obviously. <laughs> Hi, Undyne. How are you doing today? I'm... <laughs> You're cute. <laughs> Yeah, sure. Fluster her. Fluster her real bad. <laughs> Thanks! You say that to me a lot, and I never know what to say. <laughs> but I know you can... You Bruh. just mean it platonically, because we're this fr is just painful. friends. Man, this reminds me of me and my friends. <laughs> Before we started dating. <laughs> uh, so I like to... um talk to you about something. <laughs> she uses it. <laughs> no, no, yeah. wait, no, don't do that one. Don't do that one yet. Okay. What what is it, Alphys? Cuz we're trying to help her, not just bluster her. Um, you see, I I I I haven't been exactly truthful with you. You see, I I Oh, forget it. I'm dying. I- I want to tell you how I feel. You're so brave and st strong and, and, and nice, and you're all- you always listen to me when I talk about the, the nerdy stuff. You always d d do the best to make me feel special, L like telling me that you'll beat up anyone that gets- gets in my way. I'm dying. I can't take this any longer. I'm madly in love with you. Oh. Hold me, Undyne. Hold me. <laughs> what did you just say? <laughs> what did you just say? I Undyne, I would just... Hey, whoa, wait a second. Your outfit's really cute, what's the occasion? Wait a second, are you two on a date? Uh, yes! Oh, I mean, uh, uh no! I mean, we were, but I mean, actually, we were on a romance. We were only romantically roleplaying as you. That sounds so fucking weird. What? <laughs> I mean, I mean, Undyne, I. I've been lying to you. What? About what? About, well, everything. I told you that seaweed was like scientifically important. It's just used to make ice cream. And those human history books I've been reading, those are just dorky comics. And the history movies, those those are just uh, anime. They aren't real. And that time I told you I was busy with work on the phone, I was just e eating frozen yogurt in my pajamas. I, Alphys, I, I just wanted to impress you. I just wanted you to think I was smart and cool. No, I wasn't some nerdy loser, Alphys. Undyne, I... I think you're really neat, okay? Alphys. Shh. Shh. Oh! Hey! <laughs> Alphys! I... I think you're neat too, I guess. But you gotta realize, most of what you said doesn't really matter to me. I don't care if you're watching kid cartoons or reading history books. To me, all that stuff is just nerdy crap. What I like about you is that you're passionate, you're analytical, it doesn't matter what it is, you care about it. 100% at maximum power. So, you don't have to lie to me. I don't want you to have to lie to anyone anymore, Alphys. I want to help you become happy with who you are, and I know just the training that you that you need to do to do eh, that you need to do to do that. Undyne, I'll just you. tell her. You're gonna train me? God. What? Me? God. Nah, I'm gonna get Papyrus to do it. Alphys, you stupid bitch. Get the Get those bones a shaking! <laughs> it's time to jog 100 laps 
hooting about how great we are. Ready? I'm about to start the timer. I'm dying. I'll do my best. Rug. Oh my god! She was kidding, right? Those cartoons, those comics, those are still real, right? Anime's real, right? I wish. Anime's not real. Sorry, Undyne. No. No! I can feel my heart breaking into pieces. No. I can survive this. I have to be strong for Alphys. Thank you, human, for telling me the truth. I'll try my best to live in this world. See you later. Bruh, fucking Alphys didn't even ask her out. Well, we still have more to do. Honk. Oh, bruh, is the dummy still here? No. Ring. Howdy! If it isn't my good friend who trusts me! Oh. This is Papyrus! You're also mutual friend! Alphys and I finished our training earlier. Or early. Very early. So I sent her home. Very home. Is she dead? Sephora. <laughs> uh, hang on, let me close my water. Uh, now. I feel strongly, and for no apparent reason. You should also go there. To her lab house. I have only good feelings about this. Goodbye. Why are you sweating then? Well, time to go to her lab house. Man, that was gay. That was. Like... You can never have too many hot dogs, true. Sadly, that is not that's not true. true. Damn. I told you. You didn't say anything! <laughs> oh, I, I guess the mic didn't pick it up, but I was like, sadly, that's not true. Alright, uh... But yeah, that was gay, huh? It was. Anyways. In so Alphys is like a is like a hedgehog, right? Or a porcupine? Kind of. No. Then the emoji. Hmm. Hey, a suspicious from letter. Alphys. <clears throat> Read it. Yeah, sure. Why not? It's hard to read because of the handwriting, but you try your best. Hey, thanks for your help back there. You guys, your support really means a lot to me, but as difficult as it, as it is to say this, you guys alone can't magically make my own problems go away. I want to be a better person. I don't want to be afraid anymore. And for that to happen, I have to be able to face my own mistakes. I'm going to start doing that now. I want to be clear. This isn't anyone else's problem but mine. If you don't ever hear from me again, if you want to know the truth, enter the door north of this note. You at least deserve to know what I did. What did she do? Hey look, it's an elevator. Mm -hmm. Warning, warning. Elevator oh, losing shit. power. No! Altitude dropping. No! We're oh, dead, shit. let's go! No! So sad. Oh. 
None of the buttons work. It seems to have lost power. Oh, this is scary. You know, when I first went through Undertale, I thought it suddenly shifted into a horror game, and I was like, huh? Yeah, it kind of looks like a horror game. Entry number one. This is it. It's time to do what the king has asked me to do. I will create the power to free us all. I will unleash the power of the soul. Hmm. Entry number two. The barrier is locked by soul power. Unfortunately, this power cannot be recreated artificially. Soul power can only be uh, uh, derived from what was once living. So, to create more, we will have to use what we have now. The souls of monsters. Oh shit. Entry number three. But extracting a soul from a living monster would require incredible power. Besides being impractical, doing so would instantly destroy the hook destroy the soul's host and unlike the persist persistent souls of humans the souls of most monsters disappear immediately upon death if only I could make a monster soul last hmm. entry number five I've done it using the, the blueprints I've extracted it from the human souls I believe this is what gives their souls the strength to persist after death the will to keep the living, the resolve to change fate. Let's call this power determination. Hey, we have a lot of that. True laboratory. Uh, let me organize my inventory real quick. There's a note on the ground. You can't make it out at all. Make it- you can't make it out. Elevator, lost power, center- enter the center door. That's all you could read. Mm. Power room. Buy chips for 25G. No. Hey. Yeah, I'm just gonna buy some chips. Uh, I don't have enough money. Well, I have potato chips. Chisps. Chisp. Po Popado! <laughs> Popado! Popado! Chisps. Chisps. <laughs> God. Okay, let me get more crab apples. Uh, where do you want to go? <laughs> left or right? Uh, let's go to the left first. Okay. Entry number six. Asgore asked everyone outside the city for monsters that had fallen down. Their bodies came in today. They're still in comatose. And soon, they'll all turn into dust. But what happens if I inject determination into them? If their souls persist after they've perished, then... Freedom might be closer than we all thought. Mm. <clears throat> Entry number nine. Things aren't going well. None of the bodies have turned into dust, so I can't get the souls. I told the families that I would give them the the du I would give them the dust back for the funerals. People are starting to ask me what's happening. What do I do? Hmm some kind of operating table. It's sticky. Ew. Look at these sinks. Hmm. You turned on the sink. Turn on the sink. You turned on the sink. You're wasting water. Hey. Oh. Oh, that's a ghost! Oh. <laughs> Drew near. <laughs> What do you want to do? Mm -mm. I, I guess just inspect them, you know, get check them. No data available. Mm. What 
but nobody mm. came. Um. So. Oh, so is yeah. You take out your cell phone. You can hear voices through the receiver. Come join the fun. You know, I don't think I will actually. Oh. Memory head. I see. Hmm. Refuse or join. Refuse. No thanks. That's a shame. Florium Ipsum. That's the thing that they use in documents as placeholder text. <laughs> oh. You won! Yay! There's a red key lying in the sink. You took it and put on your keychain. How many keys do we have? Like 10? <clears throat> There's a note on the ground. You can't make it out at all. Drain, dropped it. That's all you can read. Men. Click. Alright, we gotta turn on all of these. Time to go to this side. Entry number 12. Nothing is happening. I don't know what to do. I'll just keep injecting everything with determination. I want this to work. Hmm. Entry number 13. One of the bodies opens its eyes. Oh shit. Zombie! It's an empty dog food bowl. Hey look, the bed. Let me just sleep in it. That's weird! <laughs> That's a good good ghost Like Zoink Scoob! Hey! It's a booger! <laughs> oh, never mind. <laughs> Bruh! <laughs> it's too long. It's probably a hand then. Oh! So we know they aren't evil. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's this bed. Yeah. Yellow key. Whoops. Cl the clock is broken. Hey, did you know that if you take the L out of clock? Hey. <laughs> Entry number 14. Everyone that had fallen down has woken up. They're all waking up, walking around and talking like nothing is wrong. I thought they were goners. Hmm. Entry number 15. Seems like this research was a dead end, but at least we got a happy ending out of it. I sent the souls back to Asgore and returned uh, the vessel to his garden. Mm. And I called all of the families and told them everyone's alive. I sent ev I'll send everyone back tomorrow. Oh. Entry number 16. No, 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 no! See that? It's really slow to walk. Um, to walk towards it. Hey, Mitz. Oh. Hello. Okay. Hello. Hello. Okay. You see that? Yeah. I sure do. It's getting faster. Mm. There's nothing there. Except for the There's key. There's a green key. 
You took it on your keychain. Okay, let's go. Man, that wasn't weird at all. Hey. That is a head. I'll go, yeah, I'll go this way. Oh! Smells Ew. like sweet lemons. Lemon bread. Hum? Hum. You hum a familiar tune. Lemon bread's body shape. Welcome to my special hell. Oh! Ah, ah, I can't get it! No. Uh... Where do you want to- what do you want to do now? Call? Call? You called for help, but nobody came. It was but nobody shot. came. God. How are you unhug it? I don't know, wanna try? Sure. You let lemon bread be. Lemon bread's teeth shake. Stay here with me. Mm. I guess we could probably just try to get away from it by unhugging it over and over again, no? Hmm. I'm gonna scream. You wanna flex? That's what they all say. Ow. Cry. Cry. You cried as loud as you could, but nobody came. But nobody came. What an asshole. Flex! Lemon bread seems to remember something. I felt this before. Yeah. Wouldn't you know it, flexing was the answer. Man, just like that weird seahorse guy. Let me heal. A crab apple. <laughs> but, God. Papato. Papato. Chips. That's what I'm gonna be calling them forever now. DT extraction machine. Status inactive. Interesting. Oh, things are lighting up. I can't see them though. Uh. There's something here. It feels like a tree. Ripe with delicious fruit. There's something here. Something in the shape of a man. Hmm. There's a note on the ground. You can't make it out at all. Curtain. That's all you could read. Well, good thing we already have it. can't see you. And things are lighting up. I can hear mm. them. Oh boy. There's a note on the ground. You can't make it out at all. Under sheets. Click. Yellow key fits perfectly. Entry number four. I've been researching humans to see if I can find any info about their souls. I ended up snooping around the castle and found these weird tapes. I don't feel like Asphors watch them. I don't think he should. Oh? There's a VHS player with a few tapes uh, picked out beside it. They seem to be labeled in a specific order. Will you watch one? Sure. Tape one, baby. Psst. Gory, wake up. Mm -mm. What is it, dear? 
Er, and why do you have that video camera? Uh, you could read her. Shh, I want your reaction. Gori, dearest, what is my favorite vegetable? Hmm, carrots, right? No, no, no. My favorite vegetable is... Edamom. What the fuck is that? <laughs> uh. Get it? Go back to bed, dear. No, no, not yet. <laughs> now, if I were a dog, what breed of dog would I be? Hmm. I don't know, honey. What kind of dog would you be? I would be... A Mamaranian. We got a fucking comedian <laughs> over here. <laughs> you sure are excited to have this child. You know, if you keep making jokes like this, one day you could be a famous Mamedian. Well, I'm going to bed. Hey, come on, Lori. That one was funny. <gasps> You okay, didn't piece sorry. it together? <laughs> I I mean, I kind of felt it, but like I was like, mm, I don't know. I really don't know. <laughs> I know, I'm just teasing you. Good night, dear. Good night, honey. <laughs> oh dear, perhaps it's too dark in here for the video to come out. Tape two. Okay, Olive, are you ready? Hey. Do your creepy face. Ah! <laughs> oh, wait, I have the lens cap on. What, you're not gonna do it again? Come on, quit tricking me. <laughs> hey. Tape three. Howdy, Olive. Smile for the camera. <laughs> this time I got you. I left the cap on. On purpose. Now you're smiling for no reason. <laughs> what? Oh yeah, I remember. When we tried to make butterscotch pie for Dad, right? The recipe asked for cups of butter, but we accidentally put in buttercups instead. Yeah, those flowers got him really sick. I felt so bad. We made mom really upset. You should have laughed it off like you did. Um, anyways, where are you going with this? Huh? Turn off the camera? Okay. Hmm. You know, with my smooth brain, I'm trying to- I'm trying to piece together everything. But so far, I don't really got much. I don't like this idea, Olive. W what? No, I'm not- Big kids don't cry. Yeah, you're right. No, I never doubt you, Olive. Never. Yeah. We'll be strong. We'll free everyone. I'll go uh, get the flowers. Hmm. Read. Olive, can, can you hear me? We want you to wake up. Olive, you have to stay determined. You can't give up. You are the future of humans and monsters. S Olive, please wake up. I don't like this plan anymore. I- I- No. I, I said- I said I'd never doubt you. Six, right? We just have to get six. And we'll do it together, right? Hmm. You know, my smooth brain still hasn't pieced together the entirety of everything. That's fine. Oh yeah, we've read these. This way. Hmm. Enter- Entry number 11. Now that Metaton's made it big, he never talks to me anymore. Except to ask when I'm going to finish his body. 
But I'm afraid if I finish his body, he won't need me anymore. Then we'll never be friends ever again. Not to mention, every time I try to work on it, I, I just get really sweaty. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey. Oh, another ghost. It's a, a ball. Oh. Well, oh. it's dog. Five. Oh. Ah. I don't, I don't like, like this very much. I can't. Hey. Um. Uh. <laughs> It's like five cats in one. Mm -hmm. Pet. You just pet hair. Bruh. <laughs> Back in. You call the amalgamate. It bounds towards you, flicking a, a strange liquid from an orifice. Okay. Ow. Pet. Now you you pet pelt it. the amalgamate. It can, it convulses rapidly, then calms down. It rests quietly on your lap for a moment. Zzz. Suddenly, it shoots a away and crawls so wildly on the walls. Man, this is sure a nice thing to listen to. Yeah. Can you play with it? You throw your weapon into the corner of the room. Amalgamate brings it back for you. Proudly? Repe you repeat this process a few times. Now Amalgamate is very tired. It leans on- It leans uh, dripping. It's- It leans- It's dripping a- uh, Amorpheus body on you. Oh god. I mean, it's just a dog that's horrifying. It's a cat. There's cats underneath. Yeah. Pet. It starts to generate stage one happiness froth. Rabies! Froth from the mouth? I'm pretty sure that's just rabies. I mean, who's to say that's a mouth? That's just an orifice. You pet decisively. Amalgamate seems to be satisfied by all this. Pet more. You give it a tummy rub, but it's not clear where its tummy begins or ends. <laughs> okay. Play with it. Oh. That was nice. Yeah. You know? Mm -hmm. Uh, now that we turn of... that on, we could clear the thing. What does it remind you of? Petting. Um. <laughs> Lesser dog. You know? Mm. Uh, it has the same, uh, sp uh, spare pattern. The same thing to get it to be spared as greater dog. Mm -hmm. Entry number 19. The families keep calling me to ask when everyone is coming home. What am I supposed to say? I don't even answer the phone anymore. Hmm. Entry number 20. Escort left me five messages today. Four about everyone being angry. One about his cute teacup he found that looks like me. Oh, Thanks that bed is kind of moving. This is a fridge. That fridge is moving. It's empty. Hmm. Entry at number 21. I spend all my time at the garbage dump now. It's my element. Ayo. Oh. Ayo. It's so cold. Oh. 
What does heckle mean? Uh, you've asked this question at the beginning of the series. It's, I don't uh, remember. It's to like, you know like how you boo someone on stage? No, don't do that to him. He's already sad. Joke with him. Joke. You told a bad uh, pun about snow. Her expression starts to shift. Haha, <laughs> I remember. She's very tame. Smells like salty slush. Laugh. Maybe. You laugh and keep laughing. It's so funny, you can't stop. Tears run down your face. Interesting. What? You didn't do that. Snowy. Does this character look familiar? Mm hmm. Hi. Yeah, it looks like a. Snow no, Drake. Remember what it... Yeah. Remember how Snow Drake's dad said ever since his mother left. Hmm. More joke. <laughs> Thank you. Hmm. Smells like salty slush. No? Alright. Heckle time! No! That's mean! Well, it's the only thing we haven't done- well, I guess I'll joke again. She's completely calmed down. You won! Why would you heckle her like that? She's already not having a good time. Yeah. Where do I put the keys again? Uh, hmm. I already put one in here, right? Yeah, I put the yellow one. Hmm. That was just weird. Uh, that was weird. That was suspicious. Oh wait, is there anything down there? Check my brain's thinking. No, there's nothing down here. I was just disillusioned. Mm. Uh, is there any? Yeah, there is this area. I forgot. Hey, look, it's us. Golden oh flowers. God. Entry number seven. We'll need a vessel to wield the monster souls when the time comes. After all, a monster cannot absorb the souls of other monsters. Just as a human cannot absorb a, a human soul. So then, what about something that's neither human nor monster? Interesting. Entry number ten. Experiments on the vessel are a failure. It doesn't seem to be any different from the, the control cases. Whatever. They're a hassle to work with anyway. The seeds just stick uh, to you and won't let go. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Looks like a burb. Hey. Hmm. Yeah. Pick um, on. No. Seemed effective. Enough. <laughs> uh, this one. Uh. Oh. Pray. <laughs> hmm. Uh, 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 don't walk towards me like that. That's weird. Uh, clean. You wash your hands. Nothing happened. Bruh. Ew! I, heard, I saw it say, of. Uh, mystify. You did something mysterious. Reaper bird seems to remember something. Finally, someone gets it. Courage. Ribbit, ribbit. 
Interesting. Cold. Thank you. Hmm. All right, we opened all the things. Hmm. Hey. Yeah, I saw that too. Don't worry. <laughs> Spooky. Spooky scary. Oh. These are turned off. Interesting. Mm. It seems like this controls the elevator's power. Turn it on. Yeah. yeah. Oh. The g g ghosts. Hey, stop! I got you guys some food, okay? Sorry about that. They get kind of sassy when they don't get fed on time. I think they smelt the potato chips you had. And... Mm. Anyways. The power went out and I've been trying to turn it back on. But it seems like you were the one to step ahead of me. You were one step ahead of me. So it was probably just a big inconvenience for you. But I appreciate that you came here to back me up. As I said, I was afraid I might not come back. But that's not because of, the, uh, of these guys or anything. I was just worried that I would be too afraid to tell the truth. That I might run away or do something cowardly. Uh, I suppose I owe you an explanation. As you probably know, Asgore asked me to study the nature of souls. During my research, I isolated a power I called Determination. I injected it into dying monsters so their souls would last after death. But the experiment failed. You see, unlike humans, monster bodies don't have enough physical matter to, make, to take these concentrations of determination. Their bodies start to melt and lost what physicality they had. Pretty soon, all of the test subjects had melted together into those. Mm. Seeing them like this, I knew I couldn't tell their families about it. I couldn't tell anyone about it. No matter how much everyone was asking me. And I was too afraid to do any more work knowing everything I've done so far had been such a horrific failure, but now, now I've changed my mind about all this. I'm going to tell everyone what I have done. It's going to be hard, being honest, believing in myself. I'm sure there will be times where I'll struggle. I'm sure there will be times where I screw up again, but knowing deep down that I have friends to fall back on, I know it'll be a lot easier to stand on my own. Thank you. Oh. Come on, guys. It's time for everyone to go home. Oh. Power turned on. Entry number eight. I've chosen a candidate. I haven't told Asgore yet because I want to surprise him with it. The center of his garden, there's something special. The first golden flower that grew up before all the others. The flower from the outside world. It appeared just before the queen left. I wonder, what happens when something without a soul gains the will to live? Mm. Entry number 18. 
the flower's gone. Oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah. You see, I, I kind of, like, because there were so many flowers around, I was like, they wanted something that's neither human nor monster, so a plant then? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Uh, ring. It's a voice you have never heard before. You could read it. Okay. Olive, are you there? It's been a long time, hasn't it? But you've done well. Thanks to you, everything has fallen into place. Olive. See you soon. What is that supposed to mean? Hey! Going up? Hmm. The door is jammed shut with vines. Then how do we get out? Well, is you this see. Is this happen? This is... This is the area we've been to before, you know? I know, this area I know. Sands. Sands Undertale. Sands Undertale, the beloved. Yes, the beloved. Hmm. Okay, a save point. We'll stop here. Ugh. Okay. Next one will be the end of Pacifist. Wow! Uh, you know, like, subscribe, comment, uh... Commenting helps me in the algorithm. Um... I have a Kofi. I also have a red bubble, but I don't have anything on it yet. A perfect? That is it. Goodbye. Bye.